I'm Anil Kumar sharing with you an excellent question. It has been asked by my subscribers on YouTube also. I do have similar questions already uploaded, but I hope this will provide you with uh, a new way of solving this particular question and I hope that helps. The question here is, if h square plus k square equals to 23hk where h is greater than 0, k is also greater than 0, show that log of h plus k divided by 5 equals to half of sum of log of h and k, right? Some of you can pause the video, solve the question and then look into my suggestion. So let's begin with what is given to us. So we are given h square plus k square equals to 23 h times k. We know we need to do this kind of a thing, right? Now, what is the first step? For me, first step when I look at it, I want to make this as a perfect square and that too with the plus sign. Because if I take half on the left side, it is kind of, you know, times 2 and 2 can go there as a square. So I'm looking for h plus k whole square. So that is a strategy. I hope you understand the strategy. So whenever you begin to solve, you have to look for the strategy. So strategy is, let's go backwards. So when 2 comes there, it goes there. So we're looking for h plus k whole square. So how can I make this particular thing a whole square? Now, as you know, what is a plus b whole square equals to? a plus b whole square is a square plus 2ab plus b square. Now, in the given equation, we have a square and b square, which is in the form of h and k, but we are missing this term, twice these two numbers. So, what should we do? Well, easy. We should add this missing number, right? So, I will add 2hk on both sides. So, I will say plus 2hk. So, I have added that. Now, once I add, same thing on both sides, which I can do since it's an equation. Let me rewrite this. So I have h square plus 2hk plus k square equals to 23hk plus 2hk, right? So I have added 2hk on both the sides. As soon as I do that, I get h plus k whole square on this side and 25h times k on the right side. Perfect. 25 is 5 square, okay. Let's bring this 25 on this side. So we get h plus k over, or I could write 5 if that is okay for you, equals to h times k, right? See, we have h plus k whole square, and in this side we have 25, right? So 25 is actually equals to 5 squared. Do you see that? So we could divide by 5 square when we bring it on this side, correct? And then take it inside the bracket. So we get h plus k over 5, everything squared. Perfect. So that is the critical step involved here. Now we have this and we are just missing the log. So let's take log on both the sides. We get log of h plus k over 5 equals to log of h times k, right? So, so what we are approaching our solution, you hope, I hope you appreciate it, right? We are approaching our solution. Now, and this is whole square. Now, I can apply the power rule and bring this square to the left side. So, I get 2 log h plus k over 5 equals to, and I can expand it, like log of h plus log of k. Do you get it? Now we are just one step away, right? So you can now finish it off. Let me do it here and write your solution. So let's multiply by half on both the sides. So what do we get? We get log of h plus k over 5 equals to half of, let me put this in brackets now, log of h plus log of k. That is what you wanted. Perfect. So that is how we can do these, you know, follow these steps and get our solution. Now, these kinds of questions are always seen in the final test paper. So I like you to go through these steps, understand each one of these steps so that you can do a similar question, right? So 
we have examples where we have done cube of a function also look into those examples also i hope that helps thank you and all the best